My Jam Music Network. I'm Joe, and we're here with Phil Gamage, and we're going to talk a little bit about the blues scene. I grew up in Houston, Texas. There was a lot of different kinds of music around. There was uh, rock. There was blues. Country is huge in Texas. I heard a lot of different kinds of stuff. My parents' records were still around. Johnny Mathis, uh, Dean Martin. My father was a huge Dean Martin fan. My first entree into performing live music would be rock and roll, and uh, in particular, punk rock. And then as my skills improved, I started studying songwriting and so forth. Um, the, my tastes and what I wanted to play changed, and uh, I moved away from rock music uh, for the most part. Uh, a lot of that was defined by my songwriting. I'm not afraid to play around with song structures and musical ideas and break out of uh, kind of the, the limited uh, blues formula. Um, that's 12 bar blues people, in case you don't know. Um, which is tried and true and which is great and some of the greatest songs of all time are that formula. So I'm not going to knock it. I'm essentially a, a songwriter who works in the genre and the idiom of the blues. I also, you know, delve into uh, folk music, maybe a um, little country. So I grab my suitcase and I head it on down the road. So I grab my suitcase and I head it on down the road. I say goodbye, preacher. May the good Lord dress your soul. I had a group of songs that I wrote probably over the period of a year and a half and uh, my passion was I wanted to get them recorded. The song Use Man for Sale, the, the title track uh, is one that seems to, to really affect people. Ride with Railroad Bill, one of my favorites, that I took uh, a traditional uh, blues song called Railroad Bill and reworked it to my, my own thing. Uh, the music's different, a lot of new lyrics. So that was kind of taking some of those traditional and pointing it in another direction and doing something a little different with it. The song Lost in Loserville, the opportunity came when I performed uh, in the Hudson River Valley, uh, Kingston, New York. And I asked him and I said, well, I want to go the most rundown part of Kingston. And uh, for those of you who know Kingston, it's a small uh, Hudson River town. And uh, the most rundown part of Kingston by New York City standards isn't really run down, but it had a lot of character. And uh, so we, we filmed footage up there. Uh, I was going for this kind of black and white bleached out look. I have a, a website that is dedicated to my own music philgamagemusic.com um, where I have all my videos, where I have all the latest news uh, and a whole bunch of stuff. So if you really want the straight, straight story, that's the place to go about me and what I'm doing. Okay, that's it. No more work on that one. <laughs> <laughs>